you so much for coming back to the channel. You've seen the title of the video, so you know we're gonna be talking about my rig that I call disaster. But before we get to that, Bitcoin 19,857, which is fantastic. Ethereum 713, Litecoin 319. Bitcoin Cash is creeping very nicely up and up at 1,875 US dollars. Ripple has fallen. But if you're holding long term, don't worry about this. It's normal. Lots of people are probably cashing out, getting some profits, maybe moving to other cryptocurrencies. Long term, it will pay off. I'm sure Ethereum Classic 34 and Dash. Oh my God, an all time high of 1,163 US dollars in the last 24 hours. At the moment, 1,068, but it's truly remarkable. Monero still doing quite well, 343, uh, NEO 56, and Zcash is doing quite well, 487. EOS, I have a friend who invested a little bit in EOS, it, uh, it's dipping a bit, but again, long term it will pay off. NEO is going to be big, comes 2018. In fact, every single cryptocurrency, in my opinion, especially from the top ones, is going to be big. 2018 is going to be a good year for cryptocurrency right so now let's move on to the mining rig the one i call disaster i'm gonna have to say i was wrong i was completely wrong i take my words back but i truly did try everything possible uh to get the bios uh, ready to get them but it something wasn't working uh never mind that's why i like uh making those videos that's why i like the community because we can help each other we can all learn from each other and thanks to maza z beiro i i'm hoping that i'm saying it right he actually helped me, uh, he edited the BIOSes and we are now pushing 168 mega hashes, which is fantastic. Now the thing is, as you can see, I have Jeep, uh, this mining rig, by the way, it's an RX 570 gigabyte uh, mining rig. And uh, those ones are the gaming ones and those ones are the errors ones. And those ones have Samsung memory, which is uh, okay. This one is a Samsung memory, but this one is Hynix. So therefore, three different bios had to be monitored i now have the biases they're working if any of you have an issue with uh, those gpus just like i did and let's say you're pulling only 23 24 mega hashes feel free to email me my email is down below i'll forward you the the edited bios and you could be pulling the same thing as me guys as you can see right here let me show you 168 mega hashes which is truly fantastic and as you can see the watts it is unbelievable 780 watts i would say about 800 watts because it does go slightly up and then down so more or less but it, it's very you know it's around 780 800 watts let's say 800 watts to be on the safe side so as you can see in i don't have any sapphire tricks uh, installed i don't have the afterburner installed all i have is the bias edited as well as in the claymore i have the cvddc at 900 and the mvddc at 900 very simple setup and it's pulling 168 mega hashes at 800 watts i'm very happy with it i must admit guys i can't believe it i truly can't believe how you know how they're performing at least for now the temperature is a little bit high i'm working a little bit on the temperature because as you can see it's around 72 celsius i will try to push a little bit down uh, maybe if I create, uh, as you can see, my fan speed is not too high. So maybe if I increase the fan speed, I'll be able to pull, uh, well, not pull, but I'll be able to reduce the temperature of the GPUs. In the meantime, this is what obviously I'm getting 72 uh, temperature, fan 21 speed, but 168.27 mega hashes. Very, very good. Um, so let's see how much this rig is now pulling for me. So here is the numbers 168. 790 let's say 800 uh, power two percent is the pool fee 0 0.12 is the cost hit the calculate and here you go 14.32 us dollars daily thanks to of course the ethereum price being so much uh weekly 100 us dollars monthly 429 yearly 5227 i am very very happy with this rig at the moment now i know i can switch to other cryptocurrencies and i may do but in the meantime that's what i'm mining i'm enjoying obviously mining ethereum the profits are great in my personal opinion and here are all my rigs as you can see i'm pulling 820 mega hashes uh, let's see 821.4 mega hashes very very good and it's stacking very quickly obviously the ethereum that's a lot of power at least you know for what i'm having 
five mining rigs, 821 mega hashes. I'm sure I can push a little bit further, but for now I'm happy. I have another 1000 on Genesis mining, so I'm very, very happy with it. So there you have it, guys. This is all I truly wanted to share with you. Yes, once again, I was wrong, but this is why I, I enjoy this uh, community because we can help each other. Just like now, if some of you emailed me and, and asked me for the bios, I can send it over to you. Hopefully it will do the job for you as well. And you could uh, obviously start uh, mining, uh, you know, with higher mega hashes because I was truly mining very, very little. This rig on the previous video was pulling 142 mega hashes compared it to 168. That's a big, big difference. So once again, those ones are Samsung memory. So I have a BIOS for Samsung memory. This one is a Samsung memory. So I have a BIOS for Samsung memory. And this one is... Um, Hynix, so I have the, uh, the Hynix bias uh, edited, and they are RX 570 4GB uh, GB mining cards. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Thank you so much for all the help as well. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, feel free to ask me. And uh, if you enjoy the channel, feel free to subscribe and share. I will see you in the next video. Bye bye for now. He edited the BIOSes and we are now pushing 168 mega hashes, which is fantastic. Now the thing is, as you can see, I have Jeep, uh, this mining rig, by the way, it's an RX 570 gigabyte uh, mining rig. And uh, those ones are the gaming ones and those ones are the errors ones. And those ones have Samsung memory, which is uh, okay. This one is a Samsung memory, but this one is Hynix. So therefore, Three different BIOS had to be modded. I now have the BIOSes. They're working. If any of you have an issue with uh, those GPUs, just like I did, and let's say you're pulling only 23, 24 mega hashes, feel free to email me. My email is down below. I will forward you the, the edited BIOS, and you could be pulling the same thing as me, guys. As you can see right here, let me show you 168 mega hashes which is truly fantastic and as you can see the watts it is unbelievable 780 watts i would say about 800 watts because it does go slightly up and then down so more or less but it's very you know it's around 780 800 watts let's say 800 watts to be on the safe side so as you can see in i don't have any sapphire tricks uh, installed i don't have the afterburner installed all i have is the bias edited as well as in the Claymore, I have the CVDDC at 900 and the MVDDC at 900. Very simple setup and it's pulling 168 mega hashes at 800 watts. I'm very happy with it. I must admit guys, I can't believe it. I truly can't believe how, you know, how they're performing at least for now. The temperature is a little bit high. I'm working a little bit on the temperature because as you can see, it's around 72 Celsius. I will try to push a little bit down uh, maybe if I create, uh, as you can see, my fan speed is not too high. So maybe if I increase the fan speed, I'll be able to pull, uh, well, not pull, but I'll be able to reduce the temperature of the GPUs. In the meantime, this is what obviously I'm getting 72 uh, temperature, fan 21 speed, but 168.27 mega hashes. Very, very good. Um, so let's see how much this rig is now pulling for me. So here is the numbers 168. 790 let's say 800 uh, power 2% is the pool fee 0 0.12 is the cost hit the calculate and here you go 14.32 US dollars daily thanks to of course the Ethereum price being so much uh, weekly 100 US dollars monthly 429 yearly 5227 I am very very happy with this rig at the moment now I know I can switch to other cryptocurrencies and I may do, but in the meantime, that's what I'm mining. I'm enjoying, obviously, mining Ethereum. The profits are great, in my personal opinion. And here are all my rigs. As you can see, I'm pulling eight. It's very, you know, it's around 780, 800 watts. Let's say 800 watts to be on the safe side. So as you can see, I don't have any Sapphire tricks uh, installed. I don't have the afterburner installed. All I have is the bias edited. As well as in the Claymore, I have the CVDDC at 900 and the MVDDC at 900. Very simple setup and it's pulling 168 mega hashes at 800 watts. I'm very happy with it. I must admit, guys, I can't believe it. I truly can't believe how, you know, how they're performing, at least for now. The temperature is a little bit high. I'm working a little bit on the temperature because, as you can see, it's around 72 Celsius. 
I will try to push a little bit down. Uh, maybe if I cre uh, as you can see, my fan speed is not too high. So maybe if I increase the fan speed, I'll be able to pull. Uh, well, not pull, but I'll be able to reduce the temperature of the GPUs. In the meantime, this is what obviously I'm getting: 72 uh, temperature, fan 21 speed, but 168.27 mega hashes. Very, very good. Um, so let's see how much this rig is now pulling for me. So here is the numbers: 168. 790 let's say 800 uh, power 2% is the pool fee 0 0.12 is the cost hit the calculate and here you go 14.32 US dollars daily thanks to of course the Ethereum price being so much uh, weekly 100 US dollars monthly 429 yearly 5227 I am very very happy with this rig at the moment now I know I can switch to other cryptocurrencies and I may do, but in the meantime, that's what I'm mining. I'm enjoying obviously mining Ethereum. The profits are great in my personal opinion. And here are all my rigs. As you can see, I'm pulling 820 mega hashes. Uh, let's see, 821.4 mega hashes. Very, very good. And it's stacking very quickly, obviously the Ethereum. That's a lot of power, at least, you know, for what I'm having. Five mining rigs, 821 mega hashes. I'm sure I can push a little bit further, but for now I'm happy. I have another 1000 on Genesis mining, so I'm very, very happy with it. So there you have it, guys. This is all I truly wanted to share with you. Yes, once again, I was wrong, but this is why I, I enjoy this uh, community because we can help each other. Just like now, if some of you emailed me and, and asked me for the bios, I can send it over to you. Hopefully it will do the job for you as well. And you could, uh, obviously start a mining uh, you know with higher mega hashes because I was truly mining very very little this rig on the previous video was pulling 142 mega hashes compared it to 168 that's a big big difference so once again those ones are Samsung memory so I have a bias for Samsung memory this one is a Samsung memory so I have a bias for Samsung